Hack Bunny 36 here. Okay, there's not. We're not gonna do gameplays. No, not yet. I wish I what I wish I just wish I want to play some other retros like GameCube or um PlayStation 3 or Dreamcast. Those are the only consoles I wanted to play. But I'm not gonna hear talk about it, so we're gonna listen. We're gonna do something. This is a very different video. Um uh, we're today we're going to listen to this um some audio cassettes with audios from the from the Baron Stain Bears Atari twenty six hundred. They came with the cassettes of the audios and like um learnings and startup all the best vocals. So the t Atari twenty six hundred Baron Stain Bears uh audio cassette. So there's only there's three. One the numbers and spellings even the spooky ones the spooky spelling bee so without further ado let's do let's try to listen to it okay so here it is um the berenstain bears atari 2600 um these are the yeah this is what i'm talking about the the kid vid talking video game cartridge made with 2600 so the voice modules so here are the here are the four mp3 audios here so this is the kid vid baron kid vid baron stain bears audio uh, the baron stain bears sound cassette number one number two and number three so let's start listening to this one I'm sorry. A great grizzly, great grizzly, bear and stain bear. A great grizzly, great grizzly, bear and stain bear. That was pretty good. You know, whenever you hear that woman says the bear and stain bears, and that, well, everybody always remember bear and stain bears. Well, the Mandel effect, it's Baron Stain Bears. Let's try this again. So open your eye, lend an ear. Actual factual bear here, the world's smartest bear. Known far and hmm. wide, ready and willing to be your guide. Smartest bear, huh? Stay on the road, an easy trick. The joystick will do it, hurry, be quick. Push to the left to go that way. Push to the right and you'll be okay. There'll be things to do, things to learn. Honey pot and beehive points to earn. That reminds me like of my childhood. Well, not this one, not the cassettes one. I mean with the uh, the CV mu CD music videos in the early 2000s. Boulders in the road, maneuver around them. If you're quick with a stick, you'll get around them. Mm -hmm. That was short. Way to go, congratulations. May this be one of many standing ovations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I have 300 subscribers. Well, looky there, just looky there. It's our good friend, Brother Bear. Brother Bear. We've been along as nice as you please, looking for honeypot points for hives of bees. Wow. Good work, good show. That's definitely the way to go. Hmm. <laughs> Crossing a bridge is quite a trick, so get ready with your control stick. Mustn't let our good friend Brother Bear cross the bridge when it isn't there. If you only had the, uh, the Atari 2600 control, that's the option. 
Not bad, old chap. Let's take a brief pause and, and reward your effort with a bit of applause. That is a very helpful things for kids. Welcome to our game. Welcome to our bear country game. Our rolling, riding, bridge, sliding, boulder, thumping, shoulder, bumping, bear and strain, bear country game. <laughs> That's a very good jingle. That is very, very impressive. That's very amazing. All of these cassettes, uh, the these audios are very amazing, very talented. Best way to to know what to do, what kids have to do. Okay, so start with the Berenstain Bear sound cassettes number one. Let's see. Catch a number, catch a number, catch a number if you please. Move your stick and catch a number as it falls down from the trees. Not any number, not any number, not just any one you see. The proper number, the proper number mm. on this round is number three. Okay. Don't touch another, don't touch another, or a buzz is what you'll get. Don't touch another, don't touch another. Ready now, get set. Uh, no, I'm not sure that sound, that voice is from the Berenstain Bear show. Ready now, friends, so look alive. Next number to catch is number five. Five fingers on a hand, five toes on a foot. The problem at hand is very simply put. One less than six, one more than four. Catch the number five if you want to score. Hmm, uh-huh. The next thing Brother Bear has to do is catch the number known as two. So many important things we use make a habit of coming in two. Man, is he doing a bad singing? Twos, hands and feet, gloves and shoes, twins and mittens, butterfly wings, bicycle wheels, and other things. The next thing Brother Bear has to do is catch the number known as two. I like that number two. Right. I don't even know. Attention, please. Time for a quiz. The questions are, how many wheels on a four-wheel car? How many ride on a four-man sled? How many posts on a four-poster bed? You guessed four. I just said four. It is four. Hey, that's right. Way to go. Out of sight. Thinking is four. What's the boss number? It's number one. Because when all is said and all is done, you can build any number out of one and one and one and one, etc. Hmm. So get ready for some number fun and catch the boss number one. Number one. Seven. Seven. Now catch seven. seven. Look alive now. Don't touch five now. Six or nine. Now the number seven. Not one or two or four or three. So move out very carefully. Ready now. Steady now. Take your best shot. Catch seven and earn another honey pot. I wonder seven, what that voice seven. actor doing Lucky now. Seven. Her voice is talented. Ready now, steady now, doing fine. Ready now, ready, catch number nine. One less than ten, two more than seven. Next to last stop, all aboard before eleven. Mm -hmm. It's the number skaters skate. It's dinner time if dinner is late. One fewer than a baseball team. If you catch eight, you're on the beam. We are 
have gathered here, friends, to honor that very special number known as six. Six. Honoring very special numbers, friends, is how we get our kicks. Mm. Of the example, three plus three, friends, is the sum. How many legs are there in a true insect? If mm. you said six, friends, <coughs> six. you were correct. And Sorry, I wasn't even paying attention. If you go out and catch six, you will score. Six. Got it. Put a zero after one if you want to make a ten. You can add another zero to make a hundred friends. Then add another zero and a thousand's what you get. Is it zero? Or or... Make a million, no friends, not just yet. You'll need one with six zeros to be a millionaire. So if you catch the zero with the help of Brother Bear, will you earn a million? No, friends, surely not. But you could earn another honey pot. Zero. That's it. All right, let's go to the next one. Let's listen to the sound cassette number two. Oh my god, that was like nine minutes. Oh man, I'm pretty sure I hope. I hope I don't get asleep. A is for alligator, antelope, and ape. And it makes the A sound in the middle of grape. It's the very first letter of the alphabet. So catch yourself the A and a honey pot you'll oh, get. Oh, this is the alphabet song of the Berenstain Bears. B is for the bat you hit home runs with. B is for the ball that's over the fence. B is for the burger you eat buns with. And the book that keeps you in suspense. Letter B. Letter B. C. It's a little more than half an O. It's a G without its hook. It stands for cake and candy. For cow and cat and cook. It's C. It also stands for catch. So catch a C. Go for it. And have another honey pot to show for it. Okay, C. D is for drum that goes rum tum tum. D is for dumpster of trash. D is for donut that makes us say yum. D is for dive that goes splash. D is for double. D is for dare. So pitch it. Sounds like a marching band. Bear. Go catch a D. It's a D double dare. It's a D. E is a vowel like I A O U. It gives us a sound so profound. E gives us the E sound in me and she. More words than you ever could count. We don't know how many, but you can be sure it is a prodigious amount. Okay. So I just hope this sound won't let me go to sleep. Catch yourself an F and you'll be doing fine. An F is just an E without a bottom line. It's the start of words like fight, fix, and fiddle. The end of chef and clef. And in words like effort, it's the sound in the, the F. middle. The letter F. Give me a G, give me a G, give me a G, 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 G. Golly, gargle, goosey. Garden, giggle, garbage, I'll start with G. And there's lots and lots more, so catch a G. Go catch a G, catch a G, and score. Gee, <laughs> whoop, yep. That's what I danced as a kid at elementary school. Though H starts words we have good times with This like 80 song and relaxes heart And health and Halloween It's the only letter nothing rhymes with At least no word we've ever seen H stands for hurry and hammer hair and hot It all 
also stands for Honey Pot Catch H. H. This very important letter, in case you haven't heard, also happens to be a very important word. It's the singular personal pronoun. As in me, myself, and I. I. It gives us the I sound in high pie and sigh. It's very simple looking, a straight line with a dot. On capitals, catchy, hold the dot. Catchy, catchy letter the I. Better not do it. Catch I. Catch pie or I. Catch a J, friends. Look alive. J. It's time to do the jelly jam jive. That's my first letter of my name. Start yeah. J. J. K is for kiss and for kangaroo. Hmm. Also, could you so go kachoo. catch a K? It's the what thing the heck is a kachoo? Do. Catch K, catch K, or catch C. L is a special letter, oh. it stands for love. Uh, and country music. So catch this special letter. L. Okay. You can't miss M. What I mean? Two mountains pointing up and a valley in between. So move out there with Brother Bear and pluck that M right out of the air. Catch M. Now that's the best, like, Western music. Did I say that? Did I say that? That that is the best Western music. Calling all players, calling all players. Now catch N. Now catch N. When last seen was the 14th letter in the alphabet. There is a reward. There is a reward. If you catch N, a honeypot is what you'll get. Catch in. Calling all players. Calling all players. Now catch in. Catch in. I gotcha. O is the perfect letter. Oh, oh, oh. Round as a donut's hole. Oh, oh, oh. To catch this perfect letter is your immediate goal. Catch yeah, it's o. six minutes. Oh. P is the next letter. Q it's the o first and last letter in the pop. W X Y. You recognize it easy. Ten more alphabet levels to go. A line with a loop. It's a line with a loop at the top. Catch P. P. P P P P. Chef P P. Q's an O with a tail. It's the first sound in quail. But there's something much odder about it. When a word has a Q, mm. it's always followed by a U. True. It never appears without it. Catch that, Q. That's true. Stands for queen. Said the letter P to the letter R. R is the next letter to catch. We're a little alike, but with that extra leg, we're not exactly a match. Eight more alphabets. With its graceful curve, its double swerve, S is a lovely sight. Its only disadvantage is it's the hardest letter to write. That's beautiful. That is the most beautiful music. I really love this one. It stands for toy. Uh huh. And uh -huh. tall and tree. Oh yeah. Catch a T. Catch a T. Also for telephone and talk. And TV. That's true. You can easily catch a T. 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 U stands for up. It's the middle of up. It stands for underwear too. 
What? Eight minutes. There once was a letter named V, mm -hmm. which gave oh. us the V sound you see. Okay. The V sound in very violin and volcano, and my friends, as also you may know, V stands for victory. Catch V. Now that's a victory. Hmm. We speak now of W, a letter of honor and fame. And though we hate to trouble you, we must tell you that W is the next letter to catch in our w. game. Catch W! Three more alphabets. <clears throat> in higher math, X is the unknown. X-ray pictures show the bone. Mm -hmm. It's the start of the xylophone. Mm -hmm. In mysteries, X always marks the spot. Catch X and earn another honey pot. Catch X. X marks the spot. Y stands for yo yo and yip so a city in Michigan State. Michigan. So go catch a Y. It's made of three lines, two of them slanty, one of them straight. Catch Y. Hmm. It See. To here, but we're finally here. At the very last letter of the alphabet trip. The zigzag Z. Do not let it give us the slip. Catch Z. That was amazing. That was so amazing. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Why did I even listen to this? So this might be the alphabet. Fun numbers and la words. I wonder what the third one does. Okay. Hold on. Let's do it. Is it sound? Has it pussy foots around? I forgot. It's a spooky spelling bee. The mice tried to bell it. Now you can try to spell it. The first word is cat. Meow. Spell cat. Meow. What's next? I'm <laughs> the word one. Spell my name right. Or word I one. come to haunt you in the middle of the night. <laughs> spell one. Okay, one. That's it. It's the color of a radish, the color of a rose, the color of a root of the reindeer's hmm, nose. I'm pretty it's sure that's the witch a singing that. Hummingbird. Red. Spell red. Our very next word. Okay, red. The very next day. You have to do is spell the word for the number two. Spell mm. two, spell two. Oh, God bless you. Oh, hey, someone's sneezing. I left my dog sitting on a log, but when I came back later, the log turned out to be an alligator. Chomp, yum, chomp, chomp. <laughs> spell dog. Dog. Six. Spell six. six. Don't whimper and whine. Whimpering is definitely out of line. Six. Spell six and you'll do fine. Okay. I once knew a chap with a pointy hat. Why wear a pointy hat, I said. Very simple, said the chap as he tipped his hat, revealing his pointy head. Hat. hat. Spell hat. Gotcha. Spell ten. Spell ten. And do it on the double. If you can't, you're in big trouble. 
trouble. Bell ten. Ten. Oh. What this word is doing in our spooky spelling bee hmm. is a very major puzzlement to me. What is it? It's much too nice, far too fine. The word is mom. Mom. Everybody's Valentine. Mom. Spell mom. Okay, I don't know. Every single lass and lad is hereby directed to spell the word dad. Dad, spell dad. I thought that he's gonna say spell death. Okay. You can hit it, bounce it, bunt it, punt it, kick it around. Never complains, never makes a sound. You can also spell it. Ball. Spell ball. Hey, speaking of balls, I heard this audio before. When I threw my hook into the sea, it was my wish to catch a fish. There was, however, one problem, you see. I didn't catch the fish. The fish caught me. Help! Fish. Spell fish. So the pirate's supposed to be on spooky? Or spooky? Spelling B is the word for the product of three times three nine spell nine nine the bear went out on a spooky night. He prayed for the moon to give him light. But the moon man hid, and as the bear feared, it got so dark he disappeared. Bear, spell bear. Bear. Not too spooky. September. <clears throat> Carefully we open the creaking door. And what do we find? The next word to spell is number four. <laughs> four. Spell four. I like that one. Oh, okay. Not too spooky. I've been told by a little bird that the very next word is bird. 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 Spell bird. Not too spooky. Okay, this might be I interesting. I think that I shall never see a poem spooky as a tree who stares at me with not all eye, its branches clawing at the sky. A tree which may in summer wear ten caterpillars, so beware its gnarled bark and ugly frown. What to do? There's just one answer. Chop it down! Tree. Spell tree. Three or tree? Is that what you're saying? I love rocks. I always will. Slate and sandstone. Mm -hmm. Give me a thrill. Marble, granite, mica schist. All of them are on my list. But rocks do have a serious lack. They never, ever love you back. Rock. Spell rock. Rock. I 
I opened up a book with spooky stories in it. Those stories were so spooky, I jumped out of my skin. Book, spell book. Book, spell book. One time as I was traveling, I came to a fork in the road. Mm -hmm. And there my legs were tired, and my back was bare. A serious question came to mind. How come it's always a fork we find in the road of life, and not once a napkin or a spoon or knife? Road. Spell road. That was it. That was it. That was it. Wow. That was the... I love this one. Oh man, I, I can use I can use one of those sounds for my future videos, right? Anyways, hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe.